My name is Esther Gloria Mbabazi and I'm a research assistant with the International Institute of Tropical Agriculture, IITA, in Uganda. Uh, my name is uh, Dr. Florence Birunji Chaze and I'm a lecturer in the Department of Extension and Innovational Studies, School of Agriculture Sciences, Makerere University. We are trying to like do an analysis and see like the potential of most of these crops including livestock, where the farmers are investing a lot of their energy, yeah, and time, and resources on top of that, and trying to do an assessment for them to see what yields more. If someone weeds cassava for two hours, they have to write that. If they harvest so many tubers, they have to record it, and some of them thought it was hectic work, and they were not seeing a direct tangible benefit. But actually, when we gave them pre preliminary results, on what they had been doing and was showing them now this particular farmer was investing so much time in this and according to the records they are yielding so much here and they are selling a bit of this and consuming this they realized actually they can do farming as a business and when they do record they get to understand where they are investing most what is bringing in more and where they should pay emphasis and it was very fulfilling in that even those that had been a bit lazy at recording picked it up there is a lot I can attribute to award. For starters, when I joined award, when I won the fellowship, I was a um, student and I didn't have a job. And uh, through award, they were um, teaching us how to network, how to be more visible, yeah, and how to market ourselves out there. So after MOW, I had this passion about being able to stand on my own, having a sense of belonging and winning whatever I put my mind to. Because through the MOW, I realized I have the potential. And I had that line at the back of my mind, feel the fear, but do it anyway. So when I, um, time, when I saw the advertisement for my current job, I did apply with help of my mentor who did recommend me, yeah? And since it's a CG center, I added that as a plus in my application, showing that I'm an award fellow and award is also one of the CG centers. So I go for my interview and uh, I was pretty eloquent in driving my points across and on the board they were asking me about award, this thing you put in uh, your application, isn't it a commitment elsewhere, how will you run it alongside and I was telling them what we benefit from award, you become a much better leader, you acquire more science skills and they hired me because unlike my other competitors I was coming on with a plus. They were going to benefit from another organization that they were not necessarily investing into and they knew the skills I would acquire would be a plus to the organization. Yeah, so that was one way in which um, award benefited me and uh, putting me on the map and making me a lot more visible. The relationship between a mentor and a mentee is really complementary uh, because when we go out to do research, the mentees do work that is supposed to do our to be our work and we benefit from that which increases our efficiency in either submitting the research reports or writing our, our research outputs. But I think also mentoring is a wake-up call for you to pick up your tools and move your career path because since I got Gloria as my mentee I'm working very hard on publishing papers because I don't want her to see that I'm not progressing. Because I know she, <laughs> at the back of her mind she's also checking. She's telling me to walk her career path. Is she walking, walking her career path? And in my institution, that is the School of Agriculture Sciences, we boast about being mentors. At least I know two mentors in my department, uh, uh, Professor Margaret Mangena and I. And we talk about it in the corridor that we are mentoring these students. We talk about it in the departmental meetings. So this also increases our vi visibility as women who can move things. It increases our strength as leaders and it makes us, I have not attended the negotiation, uh, negotiation skill workshop, but I attended the leadership skill a workshop and I think it has helped me to be very open. I can now go to my head of department, to my principal and openly tell them what I want. Mentoring is a journey that is walked by both the mentee and the mentor. 
there must be that commitment between the mentor and the mentee to make this journey a reality. Uh, I'm grateful that I've been a fellow, I've walked the fellow journey, and I've also walked the mentor journey. But these two have been a wake-up call for me to get up and shine. And I think I'm shining more as a mentor than a fellow. That is uh, what I really think. And I think I'm very, very grateful that Gloria selected me to give back to an organization that also once supported my mentorship fellowship. Thank you.